Hi everyone, this is Sandy. Welcome back to Easy Cooking. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make a cake. This one is an individual lemon cake, so it's perfect for Mother's Day. The preparation time and the cooking time combined is going to be less than an hour. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Let's get started. Remember, you will find the list of ingredients in the description box of this video and you will also find it in my blog where you can print the whole recipe. Let's get started. Preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Now in a bowl, combine the flour with the baking powder and the salt. Stir well and set aside for a minute. In an electric mixer, now mix the milk with the butter and the egg yolk. To this, also adding the vanilla extract and the lemon zest. Mix on high until everything is well incorporated. It will take about 2 minutes or so. Now set the speed to low and then add in the sugar. Now set the speed to high and continue to mix on high for about 3 minutes or until the sugar is well dissolved and the water has melted with the rest of the ingredients. Once everything is combined, now set the speed to low and now we're going to add in the flour mixture. Mix on medium low until everything is well incorporated into a smooth batter. Now butter and flour your pan, I'm using a 5x5 heart shaped pan. Then pour the butter into the pan and I don't want the cake to overflow so I'm using the leftover butter to make 4 mini cupcakes. Now we're going to bake this at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 25 to 35 minutes or until the cake is cooked. You will know the cake is cooked when you insert a toothpick right in the middle of the cake and it comes out with a little bit of breadcrumbs. The mini cupcakes will cook in about 10 to 12 minutes, so keep an eye on them. Once the cake is cooked, now let it cool in the pan for about 10 minutes. Then run a knife around the edges of the cake and then transfer it to a cold surface to cool completely. Now to make the icing, in an electric mixer, we will combine all the ingredients for about 4 to 5 minutes or until the icing is nice and fluffy. I kept my mixing bowl in the freezer for about an hour before making the icing, but this step is optional. And like I said, just mix all the ingredients on high speed for about 5 minutes or until the icing is thick and fluffy. Once the icing is done, you can place it in the refrigerator until you're ready to use it. Once the cake is completely cold, we can decorate it. But first, we're going to slice it in half horizontally so we will have a two layer cake. Now, top the bottom layer with the lemon curd. Make sure it's a nice even layer and then place the second layer of the cake on top. And now we can ice the cake. You already know my decorating technique is very simple. I'm just using a small knife to cover the cake with the icing. And it doesn't have to be perfect at all, I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of shredded coconut over the icing, so the shredded coconut is going to cover any imperfections. So just cover the cake with the icing and then sprinkle shredded coconut over the icing. And I will also decorate with these roses, I bought them at Michael's and they look super cute on my cake. They add a touch of color and the cake looks so pretty and elegant is perfect for Mother's Day. I will also decorate the mini cupcakes with the leftover icing and the shredded coconut and that's about it, I'm done. Enjoy! To print this and some other delicious recipes, please don't forget to visit my blog, the link is going to be down below. And remember, you will also find me on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, on Pinterest, I'm everywhere, so the links are going to be down below. If you want, you can check them out. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel to be notified of future updates. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!